Hey, how's the Cowboy Boss here? How are you doing? So, Cowboys versus Commanders. Last game of the football season. You know who I'm rolling with. I'm rolling with the Cowboys. All right. So, should we just get screwed? Get healthy, stay healthy as possible. Yeah, because we cannot, we're going we're gonna, to, you know, most likely play a, play the, play the Buccaneers anyway. You know, because all the Eagles got to do is win. And, and all that, so... But, if you go for the win and the Eagles lose, you got the division title. But, <laughs> if the Eagles and 49ers lose, we got home field, and we win, we got the home field advantage. Um, yeah, but you want, you, you want to make sure that you're healthy as possible. I get it. I'm going to take this a little different. Last year, penalties. Offensive line wasn't that good. Defense was making highlight reels, making you know, you know, you know a lot of make, uh, highlight reels. The problem was it was that we was allowing at the same time too we was allowing a lot of big drives, a lot of a lot of big plays. You know, we was we'll get an interception on the very next play. We allow a sixty yard bomb or forty yard run. Or forty yard touchdown run or whatever. You know, and all those mistakes, all those all those flaws that we were showing that in that year last year came to bite us in the ass against the against the um forty nine. This year was a tale of two tapes and you know, for the most part in the beginning of the year, the penalties I was getting pissed, I was like, same thing gonna happen if we don't clean this up. Sure enough, you know, penalties was driving me crazy, but the one great thing was is that we got better at it. You know, we, the penalties wasn't coming as much. We lowered down our penalties, you know, you know those mental errors. And another thing, too, was like whenever we had a superstar player go down, we would just go off, just uh, enjoy the games, right, and whatever. <laughs> Cooper Rush and the defense, did a, you know, Cooper Rush was, he wasn't putting great numbers, but he was winning. Our defense was was making sure that that was happening by keeping teams on the point on the twenty points and all that you know, for the, for a lot of part of the season for the for a lot of part of the season, and then we was just you know there was some concern because of the first game against the Bucks and all that, but Dak started scoring Dak started getting like oh man we getting point we getting more points now, and all that, but then two bad things started happening. <laughs> You know, well, bad pay calling was one thing as well too. I can I can throw that as an addition, but Dax interceptions, and our defense started because it was on the field so much, and you know, and the bad and the, and getting put in bad situations like, like I said with Dax interceptions and all that, it started it started you know started, you know the performance of our defense started going down and down and down. And all that, you know. And this wasn't just the amount of interceptions. It's where those interceptions was. And that's why in this game, you know what? If we're going to play Dak, I, I don't need Dak to throw for 300 yards and three touchdowns just to make a statement. I know Dak can put points on the board. What I want Dak to do is correct that mistake. So, of just like knowing when to throw the ball away. Knowing to run when, run when you need. You know, I wouldn't want to see him running too much, <laughs> but um, but just to get that out of the way and just not turn over the ball <clears throat> and all that. Defensively, you know, like I said, our performance was going down and down and down, and you know, and I think our confidence a little. I think the defense confidence is a little shook on that. Maybe this is a game where you play it in, and you know, you know you. Even though it's just a, a rookie kid like like Sam Hall, you keep you, maybe this you know like you know how when you play basketball you know and you, you hear about this all the time when NBA players they're struggling from the field they cannot hit a shot to save their life, and all of a sudden they go they go they get fouled they get to go to the free throw line, and they hit that shot and all of a sudden it's like, then he starts hitting shots, maybe that's what we need in this game maybe we just need a game where we see that we we're getting off the field on third downs. That we're that that we that we can hold the team, you know, the ultimate goal will be holding the team under twenty points. And then and then maybe that reunites like, hey, we 
we, we can do it, you know, and all that. Because bottom line, if that throws interceptions, it doesn't matter how healthy we are. If if our defense cannot can get that confidence again, we're gonna lose because these are playoff teams. These mistakes, these types of performances cannot happen in the playoffs. So you can scratch all the things like, hey, we can be healthy as possible and all that kind of stuff. We're gonna lose if we don't fix what we need to fix. I said it last year and I'm saying it again. These type of things cannot happen because we're gonna lose in the playoffs. Anyway, that's my video. Mahalo for watching. Pani all the boys. Who you with? You know who I'm with? I'm with the Dallas Cowboys. <laughs>